Welcome back everybody to everybody's favorite Canadian gaming channel and movie reviews. Canadian, because I'm obligated to mention that I'm Canadian. Thank you to the CRTC and Mr. Justine Trudeau. So if you are still on the fence about which console you should be buying, the PlayStation 5 or the Xbox Series X, if you are a content creator and or a streamer. So watch the full video and I'm going to give you guys all the details you'll need to know about the Xbox Series X. Right, so I do have an official gameplay channel called Jigavega Alpha Gamers. Check it out, but only after you watch as much of this video as you can absolutely suffer through. So I also did a unboxing of the Xbox Series X when it first came out. So I've had this since pretty much uh, week two of the console's life. So it's about two years old. So it is heavier than it looks. So I'm just gonna give you guys a quick look in case you've never actually seen the Series X. Yes, it looks like a fridge. All right, so this is the boy itself. So it comes default a one terabyte hard drive. So it's my opinion that both when it comes to technology and games, it's my opinion that both the PlayStation 5 and the Xbox Series X are both great consoles. Both of them have amazing games and the graphical capabilities are both amazing. And each one has its own advantages and disadvantages that the other one doesn't have. Some pros to the Xbox Series X if you are a content creator. When you record a one hour video in 4K, 60 frames per second on the Xbox Series X, the file sizes comparing it to the PlayStation 5 are significantly smaller. So you have the PlayStation 5 recording a one hour 4K 60 FPS uh, video will be about 25 gigabytes, whereas this one will clock you in at about a little bit under or a little bit over 10 gigabytes. So that is a major, major advantage for the Xbox. So you can definitely record a lot more gameplay. The quality is still top tier, as good as the PlayStation 5. But here is a major con. When I'm playing a game on the PlayStation 5 and I do recordings, I always, as I'm recording, take snapshots of cool scenes in the game as they happen. And when that happens, there's absolutely nothing that happens to the video on the PlayStation 5. There's no interruptions or lags or pauses while the console is processing the image or images that I just took. And all the captures I take on the PlayStation 5 are PNG files. Now, for some reason, and I've also posted this on Twitter and tagged Microsoft to address this, but they've never responded. When you are recording gameplay and you take a screenshot, the amount of time that it takes for the console to process the screenshot is the amount of time that goes missing from your gameplay recording. A horrible example of this, when I was playing Mass Effect, the Legendary Edition, I was fighting one of the bosses and I took about 10 consecutive shots and there was a minute and a half missing from the game uh, from the gameplay uh, capture and it was very very jarring so I have since because of that I have since stopped recording gameplay on my Xbox Series X because I cannot take pictures at the same time as recording video. So this is something that's important to me. It might not be important to you, but it's important to me. Now, should you get a PlayStation 5 or should you get an Xbox Series X if you're a streamer? So let's start with the positive. 
if you are a Twitch streamer, Twitch comes pre-installed with the Xbox and you can easily do your live streams from the Xbox to your Twitch account, no problems. But if you're a streamer and you are on YouTube, like me, because I can't stand Twitch, you cannot by default stream with the Xbox Series X, Series S, or any of the previous consoles. There's workarounds, but they're hella annoying. So that is why I never stream from my Xbox and I only stream when I stream from the PlayStation 5. Another point for content creators, PlayStation 5. You can record yourself playing the game and if you have a microphone or if you have a compatible headset that records your microphone, it will capture it directly on the PlayStation 5. Don't use the controller for it. It is garbage quality recording from the microphone. It's garbage. It's absolute freaking freaking garbage. But when you compare it to the Xbox, it's light years ahead because even if you have, if, even if you are recording your gameplay and you have a headset with a microphone and you're recording, your microphone feed will not for whatever stupid ancient reason will not record while you're playing a game. The only use the microphone has is for when you are doing streamings. So these were the three, these were the four major considerations on whether or not you should buy an Xbox Series X if you're a content creator or streamer. So just to do a quick recap, Xbox Series X, 4K recordings, much smaller file sizes, amazing quality. Interruptions of your video during screenshots does not happen on the PlayStation 5 or the PlayStation 4 for that matter. You cannot record your microphone audio while you are recording gameplay on the Xbox. And if you are a streamer, you can only stream by default to Twitch on the Xbox Series X. So if you guys found this video helpful, please help me out. Your Canadian YouTuber, obligated to mention it, Canadian YouTuber. Thank you to Justine Trudeau. It's Trudeau, I have to, if I want the CRTC to allow my videos to be seen. So help me out by leaving a like on the video, leave a comment if you wish, and please subscribe to the channel for more movie reviews, social commentary, that horrible, horrible She-Hulk show. And I will be back with more content. I appreciate you giving me a few minutes of your time. Jigga Vega.